how difficult is the airbrush really? Now this question gets asked an awful lot. Let's look at the skills that we need in order to be able to use the airbrush. We need to have some degree of manual dexterity and we need to have some degree of control over our forefinger, okay? So the basic skill of using the airbrush is simply this. We push down for air, we pull back and control how far we pull back for how much paint we spray, and then we close it. That's essentially all it is. Now let's look at all the skills that I know you already have. You can write with a pen, right? That is extremely non-intuitive, but you've mastered it. It gives you all the same elements of control that you need to control the airbrush. You can probably paint with a paintbrush, some of you to an astonishing degree of accuracy and control. There's many, many things about the paintbrush that are not intuitive. One example, if you're using a paintbrush with bristles of any length at all because you want to hold some paint in there, as you're moving that paintbrush, the tip is lagging behind where your hand is. That is not intuitive, but you've mastered it. Now, all of these things are simpler on the airbrush because the paint goes exactly where you're pointing that pen-like tool which you are already familiar with because you can write. So if you think that the airbrush is gonna be difficult, I'm really here to tell you that all my 25 years of experience with the airbrush, the rate of adoption and the ease of adaption that I see with people that pick up the airbrush is always far, far faster than what they think they're gonna be. So if you think it's difficult for you, I'm gonna tell you right now, you're almost certainly wrong. And it's almost certainly gonna be easier than what you think.